Welcome to Guernsey in the Channel Islands. And at the moment we are currently at Les Coat Hills, which is in St. Peter Port. And we're heading on down the hill. Uh, Les Coat Hills, lovely hotel, really nice venue, great sea views as well. In today's video, I'm going to take you down like the back streets of St. Peter Port. Even if you visited Guernsey, you may not have been down these places. It's a really tiny little lanes they're all downhill and you see some really unique little houses and some really unique views so uh, stay right to the end because we end up at the marina down at St Peter Port this is the got to be the most peaceful walk I've done for a long time you can see in the distance we got the beautiful views out to Herm, Jetu and Sark and uh, I'm going to show you various places of interest I think you'll love this one and I'm just going to show you the first thing is uh, we've got parking zones in Guernsey if you have driven in Guernsey you'll be aware of these I'll just show you this sign so it's not paid parking but you do you have got set periods of time so look it just says here you can park any 10 hour period which ends between 6 a.m. and 6 p.m. you just set your little parking clock and there's actually a disabled badge holders right where I'm stood so you could park here Right, let's head on down. Uh, so you can see we got the cruise ship. There can't be many cruise ships left for this year. I think this one of, might be the last one, or well, there might be a few more, but there's not many. So we've got a few options here. I'm going to go right. But I'm just going to show you this uh, bit of signage here. Some interesting stuff for you to see. So no vehicles including no cycles except by permit so it's not something you'll find a lot of vehicles driving around here. Look at these views how stunning is this. If you are in Guernsey or visiting Guernsey you've got to come down here. So this is, if you head for Les Coat Hills you'll find this place. It's in St Peterport. So that cruise ship is not one of the bigger ones I've seen but it's a decent size and of course you can just see the silhouette of Castle Corner I love this look if I just show you this it gives you the directions of where everything is can you see it's just pointing towards Jersey it's pointing towards the bathing pools it's got Plymouth on there Port Grabe it's amazing gives you an idea of where you are and uh Little bins chained, so no one throws that over. I think these are people's gardens, actually. So I won't show those too much. And just a little bit of signage again. Persons using this facility do so at their own risk. Right, let's head on down. And by the way, if this is your first time at this channel, uh, I live here in Guernsey and I do videos weekly all about what it's like to live on the island of Guernsey. I show all the sites, I do drive alongs and walk alongs just like this. So if you are interested in finding out about more stuff about living on a little island, you can uh, consider subscribing to the channel because I've got a lot of uh, great stuff on here and a lot of good stuff coming up. As usual, if you do like this video, you can let me know by giving it a thumbs up. And you probably notice all these little doorways. So these are people's houses. Uh, really pretty. Very nice. Very quiet around here. I'm missing a walk around this car. Those are the little uh, bags you put your rubbish in. I was on the left there, I don't know if you saw them. So you can imagine these little lanes, tiny little roads, have been here for a very, very long time. I don't really know the last time I walked down here, but it was really nice. So you've got houses all over the wall here. Some of them have fantastic views. Imagine the view there is really nice. They're looking out towards the islands and on a nice day you can obviously see Jersey which is in the other channel island about around 20 miles away Jersey. 
I just noticed actually on the right here on the wall I'm just going to show you uh, it looks like there's some graffiti and I do not know the last time I saw any graffiti in, Ger in Guernsey so this is quite rare I would say let me know in the comments if you've ever seen graffiti in Guernsey but I don't even know the last time I saw it so that's quite a rare thing to see Let me know if you've ever walked down this little lane because uh, I don't know if many people do. I imagine if you live around here, you do. Be interested to know. Now, just on the road, just you look to the bottom there, you see that drain. I was just thinking to myself, when it rains, I bet the water pours down here. I see they've got a little drain to capture most of it, or else it'll be like a, a river down this when we get heavy rain. So I'm just going to go around to the right here and you can see we're slowly getting down towards the marina and there's a little road down here so I could go down there there's quite a few places to explore actually walking around here but I'm going to stay on my planned route I'm going to head on down and um, I'm pretty sure these steps are called Corbin steps C O R B I N Corbin steps. But I haven't seen any signage anywhere, so I'll keep an eye out. I could be wrong. I'm sure these were. Just make sure I don't slip. Now I can see something, there's a sign on the ball there, can you see it? Am I wrong? Oh, I don't know, I think it says... Yeah, no it is. Corbin Steps. I don't know, I knew that. But yeah, there's a bit of a sign about the household refuge collector, collection days. Right, we're getting on to a normal looking road now. <laughs> There's quite a. I think this road's actually closed. I'm pretty sure ca uh, cars can't drive up past these barriers um, unless you have access to your premises. Maybe I'm trying to see. Can I get around here? Um, possibly just drive around in a car. So a lot bigger road now bigger houses There's a bloke there doing a good job cleaning the windows. He can come to my house if he likes and leave my windows cleaning. So I shot this on a Saturday. Don Street, yeah, no entry down this way as well. So you can see the cars at the bottom. So we're coming to like a busy uh, part of St. Peterport. The give you your bearings. The if you do are familiar with Guernsey, the main roundabout in Guernsey is just to the right at the end of this road. Um, and Salary Corner is just slightly to the left. I'll just uh, give you a good shot. Look how clean that glass is. Do you think he's cleaned that already? It looks pretty clean to me. Wow. So I'm just gonna cross the road. You can't turn right here if you're driving. You can only go left. 
and I'll show you just where the roundabout is. So there's Marina. And I'll just show you to the right. There you go. There's the roundabout. Thanks for watching. Click the screen to watch another video. And remember, if you do want to see more stuff, consider subscribing. Till next time, take care.